Okay, we have the Aqua One Nautilus 2700 UVC head unit for the canister filter. Now, if you need to remove the UV, and this is a section for the UV, and this is a section for the impeller. So to remove it, firstly what we've got to do is turn here in an anti-clockwise direction, and you'll notice it'll start moving back from the UV section. When that's back, we then turn again in an anti-clockwise direction, which will unscrew the housing for the UV. Now, once that's all unscrewed, now keep in mind that the UV bulb itself, you shouldn't put your fingers, you shouldn't actually touch the bulb, but then you'll be able to remove it when it does need to be removed. So then we put the housing back on and we just screw it into position and we do this by just lining up the hole with the section again now while we've got that out from that section there we can get to the impeller but there's a little cap here the little cap is designed to just hold it in place without it being moved so we need to just it's a pull out cap and it just pulls out and just holds it in position. So once that's done we can then turn it again in an anti-clockwise direction and then you'll have access to the impeller. So you've got a ceramic shaft, just be careful they're a little bit easy to break and then you have the impeller that you can remove that just needs cleaning so just make sure everything's fine on the impeller and cleaned once it goes back in and then we can line up with our holes to go in and again this will just turn to put it back in to position then we put the little pin in to hold it in position then it's just a matter of screwing back the cylinder We'll then put it into position. And now that that's in position, the water will flow through the impeller into the UV. And that's a way that you get to it to actually clean the impeller and get to the UV. Thank you.